Hi friends, I just want to explain a project on Node MCU. So basically your Node MCU is helping to do applications in all uh, regular as a microcontroller and most of the cases you will go with IoT applications. So again, uh, I am not using the IoT part. So I am trying to do application with access point and you should understand access point means so local Wi-Fi communication will help us to communicate your controller with mobile app as well as well URL link. Okay. So so first I'll, I'll show the output with Node MCU uh, with mobile app using a local Wi-Fi communication. So this is your Node MCU and I'm using built-in LED which is connected with the D0 pin basically D0 pin which is connected with the LED from the board so here so I just did a simple application by using MIT app inventor so this is the local app I just created by using MIT app inventor so for this you should connect your Wi-Fi name provided in the program so I just given Wi-Fi name as ESP8266 this is the my access point name I just given already password so this password which is one to eight digits. So once you connected with the local Wi-Fi with the node MCU, you can open your app. And you can use these buttons to see the response of LED. So once you click on LED off, the built in LED goes off. And if you click on LED on, it goes on. So this is not complete IoT but using local Wi-Fi communication you can operate the digital IOS connected with the microcontroller. Okay. So this, this is a simple output with LED on and off. So now I just want to uh, give you the complete code. You can subscribe the channel and I'll give the complete code on link description link so you can you can see the code I just use a li library for ESP8266 and this name so you can keep it as user defined and the password which is whatever the access point name you want to provide you can give it any name and this is a server I'm just creating So this access point and Wi-Fi password you can give it as your own and you need to create one HTML server so this is a simple server you are just creating so once so if you write your own HTML code the web page should be like this with a standard IP 192.168.4.1 so this is a head and these two are the buttons as per the code. You can edit as per your requirement. You want to give it any other title, you can give it. And you can name the buttons as per your thing. And now, so this is the LED pin number, which is D, D0 from Node MCU, which is built in already. And you want to connect any external LED, you can change the names and you can go with your own pin numbers and the setup part just which is configured as output and I'm just doing the connection with access point and once you begin the server your HTML code will run on the specific IP and here I'm just taking the response from client 
now node mcu is the client and you are just reading the response from the server so based on the return value so whatever the request you got it from your server which is led on and led off as per this you are just changing your digital pin logic as high and low so this this is the running html continuously are running html1 html2 so these are the individual strings for your html code so this is simple logic behind this and i'll also tell you so how to do with this mit app so this is a designer you can take it projects and start new project and take it your whatever the logo you want and you can go with your new two buttons individual buttons led on and led off and other important thing is blocks so the set block so this this is as per your web url response the standard ip address is 192.168.4.1 and once you button one click which is sending the response led on and you are clicking on button two which is sending led off this thing i am just comparing in the program for led on the digital pin low and led off digital pin high this is this is the simple application with node mcu in access point mode thanks thanks for watching